Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Unlock Your Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSE Mathematics Class 7 Chapter 18 Percentage and its Applications. Exercise 18E Question 1. Right, so what have you got here? It says, find the discount when the MP is 25 and SP is 23.50 and there's another part, right? So, before, uh, before solving this question, we need to understand a few things. That is, MP and discount. So, what is this MP and discount that you are seeing? This MP, this new term, this discount. Uh, so, I'll start. Uh, I'll start off with the discount first because we've heard it at many places, right? Suppose you go at a mall, you have seen at some articles like shirts or any article, there is 20% discount, 10% discount, 30% discount. So, what is this? So basically, this percent discount that you see, 20% discount, 30% discount, this is the amount that is being reduced from the marked price. Now, what is the marked price? Marked price is basically the MRP which you have seen on the back of some items. That is your MRP which is a fixed price, right? But with the help of discounts, that price can be reduced, okay? So basically, if we have to see what is the MP, that is the marked price price right it is a fixed price and on this the discount is calculated remember the discount is always calculated in percentage or fractions on the mp not on this sp okay always calculate your discount on the mp in the form of percentage or fractions so mp is the marked price or mrp right now what is this mp plus mp minus the discount right this discount so, discount is the amount that is going to be reduced from your marked price. Suppose I give you an example, the marked price is 100 rupees and the discount on that 100 rupees is of 20%. So, 20% 20 of 100 will be rupees, tw uh, 20 rupees, right? So, 20 rupees will be subtracted from 100, okay? So, this means what? 20 is your discount and 100 is your marked price. Now, what is the selling price here? Selling price is the price that you pay to the shopkeeper after the discount has been uh, reduced. Okay, so MP minus the discount will always be the selling price, SP, right? MP is the marked price, discount is the amount that is being cut off, reduced. And SP is the price that you pay after discount has been cut off, right? Now, with the help of this only, we can form uh, many formulas, right? Suppose this is for finding the selling price. If we want to find the marked price, so what we will do, the uh, so discount will come here, right? So SP minus the discount, right, will give you the marked price. Okay, remember this. And if you want to find out the discount, so the discount will always be what? Discount will be will be the MP that is the marked price minus the SP that is the selling price. Remember these three formulas pretty carefully, right? So this question says find the discount. So for this one, we'll use the last one that is MP minus SP, right? So in the first part, right, what have you got here? MP is 25 rupees and SP that is the selling price is 23.50. Again, you see that discount is equal to MP minus SP. Okay, so the discount here will be what? the marked price minus the selling price and that is marked price is 25 minus the selling price is 23.50 so 23.50 becomes your this selling price now we we will uh, subtract them solve it so you'll get rupees 1.50 right this is your discount okay or you can see the discounted amount as well okay so you see that on 25 rupees this much money is being given as a discount so this will be subtracted from 25 and that is the amount you will pay that is your selling price 23.50 then second one okay so in the second part what have you got here the mp is 1880 and the selling price is 1504 okay again same thing the discount will be what the mp minus sp so mp is 1880 minus 1504 right that will give you what? Let's see, four, 10 minus 6 is, uh, 10 minus 4 is 6, 7 minus 0 is 7, right? And 8 minus 5 is 3. So, rupees 
376 right this becomes our discount right this is our discount all right and friends this is all for today if you are new to my youtube channel do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one till then take good care of yourselves and bye